Good afternoon and welcome to another edition of Cooking with Ken. I am your host, not known as Emerald Lagasse. Today I will show you how to make pico de gallo. This recipe should actually need a recipe because it's one of those that you can actually make your own any way you want. First, I'll start with my fresh diced tomatoes. I use Roma's. A small diced onion. Some small diced green peppers. And I'm going to use some fresh chopped garlic out of the bottle. So much easier. Now I'm going to also use a little bit of garlic powder just to get the flavors incorporated throughout the entire dish. And some sea salt and no, excuse me, sea salt. Now, if you like to make this a little bit hotter, you can bam and add some jalapenos. I chose just one as it was a very large jalapeno. Now you can use any kind of pepper you want, habanero, ghost peppers, any type of a chili pepper. You don't have to even use the green bell pepper that I use. You can use orange, yellow, red. It don't matter, just make it your own. You can season this any way you like, it's yours. Last, we're going to add a fresh lime. The juice of a fresh lime. It will help bring out all the flavors. Okay, I've got all my fresh lime in here. Now I'm just going to take my big old fork, give this a good stir, get everything mixed up, because you don't want to bite into a big old wad of garlic. And there you have it, fresh pico de gallo. So easy, simple, and you made it to your own taste. Now we'll do the taste test. And in the words of the late Mr. Food, mm, it's so good. Until next time, Med Plains.